Five Minute Eats. Five Minute Eats. Five Minute Eats. Hey everyone, welcome back to Five, Five Minute, Minute Eats. Eats. We got it right this time. Yeah, today we're back at Costco. Yep, and we got a couple of things and we're going to do, the first one is Nathan's. And not just Nathan's hot dog, but it's a hot dog wrapped in a pretzel uh, bread. Bread? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, um... Now we're doing these separately, right? Yeah, we're doing them separate. So you're going to have to tune in for the next one to see what we're doing next. It's uh, it's kind of like a travel around the world yeah, series, right? Is. So this is what it is. It's like a Nathan's hot dog wrapped in pretzel. Mm -hmm. and it, Ooh, mine's coming apart. Yeah. It's splitting open on the back. So what's really cool about it, you want this one? No, it's fine. I was just showing them okay. this is what you can expect. So what's really cool about it is that Nathan's, mm -mm. you know, um, I think it's safe to say it's our favorite yeah, hot dog brand, right? Definitely. Uh, the reason is, um, who is it? Um, um, Sam's Club. Yeah. They sell it, and the problem is they used to have it at their um, you know, their restaurant mm -hmm. that they have. Then they um, switched to their own members mark one, which and is it sucks. gross. We bought yes. it. We were like disgusted. Yeah. And so, but they do sell still in the store, like the package of the big. You know, like one pound or half pound hot yeah. dogs. Yeah, select um, Sam's Club. They still carry yes. Nathan's in the frozen section, I guess you can call yeah. it, right? refrigerated. Oh, refrigerated, yeah. yeah. And uh, so we love Nathan's. Mm -hmm. And uh, when we were at Costco, we came across this and we were like, ooh, look at that. Yeah. Now, so, go ahead. Um, I just want you guys to know two ways you can make this. If you want it more crispy, you can do it in the oven. Mm -hmm. Or you can do it in the microwave and it's going to be soft. Which is how we did it. Yeah, and because uh, I don't know, we figure you know try it the easy way, right? Yeah, exactly. Because you know most of the time in the oven is going to be good. Yeah, exactly. So here's the thing about these: it was nine ninety nine for a pack of ten. However, when we got home, two of our packages were opened on the end, and so we threw them out because you never know like what could be in there. Well, here's the thing: um, I discovered when I was making these. Mm -hmm is the wrapper they come in, it's actually very, very cheap. Yeah, super cheap. So it, like, it required no strength to open it. Mm -hmm. So uh, Nathan really needs to do something about their packaging because yeah. they kind of went cheap on this. Mm -hmm. And so if they want this to be popular, they need to you know spend a little bit more money. Exactly. So how much did you say this was? This was $9.99 for a package of 10. Kind of expensive. Dollar, I think. Yeah, so let's give it a shot. Is it Cheers. worth, you know? Yeah, we got a little now, bit of ketchup here too. Yeah, so we're from Chicago, so putting ketchup on a um, hot dog is kind of considered a sin. It's the only but, way I do it. Yeah, I've always put it on anyway, and it's got a pretzel, so mm -hmm. it can break the rules. Ooh, wow. Well. Mm. The bread oh. is a lot. Mm hmm. Like, I took a bite, but a lot more came off than I expected it to. Um, I feel like I need to take another and not judge it by the end because I feel like my end bread was a little bit more tough. Because, you know, the thing is, it said it was going to be soft if you do it in mm -hmm. the microwave. So, this being a pretzel, I figured that's the way to do it. Mm hmm. And boy, I will say it tastes good. Yeah. But yeah, it's like a Nathan's hot dog. The Nathan's really hot good. dog is really good, and the pretzel is actually good. Mm -hmm. Now, here's the thing to me, this doesn't really taste like a pretzel, though. It's just bread, mm -hmm. you know, it's almost like a hot dog bun wrapped all around. I do think it tastes good. I do think that this would be super filling, though, you know, because it's a lot of bread. And typically, with a Nathan's hot dog, I could usually eat like two of those on a hot dog bun, but. This is very dense bread. Yeah. I feel like one and done for this. But yeah. I do think it tastes good. Yeah, I almost feel like this is like a whole lunch. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's how big this thing is. Mm-hmm. Hot dog is juicy, though. Got a great flavor. The bread, once I got past that first bite, it's still soft. Like, it's not too hard or anything. Mm -hmm. Not too tough to chew. I would definitely have this again. Yeah. I and mean, I think we're going to have to throw in the towel here because we got that. Yeah, we have another one to try. 
So, um, yeah, definitely this, recommend this, though. I would recommend it. Kind of pricey. Um, my question to you guys is, do they sell this at the Nathan's in New York? Yeah. You know, is this like a common feature at the Nathan's in Coney Island and all that kind of stuff? Yeah, like is it something on the menu that you can get? And it is. if it is, how much is it for one of them? Mm -hmm. That's a good question. Um, definitely would recommend this. It is, like I said, like very filling. Mm -hmm. um, so, you know, you this is not really a snack. Yeah, it's more like a... One of these in a bag of chips, you know, or one of these in like I would a say, little something, and that's your whole lunch. I was going to say this and a drink. Yeah, that's you. Yeah, that would, just, <laughs> that's it, man. But it's really, really good. Nathan's, great job on innovation. Mm -hmm. um, do something about the packaging, though. Yeah. Make sure to follow us if you like um, Costco food, Costco hauls, Costco Sam's anything, Club, Sam's Walmart. Club, food reviews yeah. in general. Because a lot of people do f reviews on fast, fast food. food, but you know what? We do that sometimes, but... But for the most part, we don't eat out a lot, mm -hmm. so we, you know, want to basically uh, review things that everyone eats, right? Yeah, things, things that, that you can get at the store. Yeah, grocery store, because we should always try to strive to eat at home more, mm -hmm. and because, uh, you know, you save more money and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and but you know sometimes you know your hard-earned money you don't want to part with it trying something new because of the fact that you know it might be a disappointment yeah so what we'll do is we'll try it for you yep and we'll let you know how it is so make sure to subscribe give us a like click that notification bell and share this video with all of your friends and family who love food as much as you do bye